Welcome everyone. Today we have honor of hosting our CEO of Revitting, Dr. Pralad Singh. Pralad, welcome to India. It's our pleasure to have you with us today. Firstly, we would like to congratulate on the remarkable eight months of success of Revity. Pralad, can you share with us some of the key highlights in terms of uh, product innovation and also if you have any plans for the future of Revity? So as we move ahead, what would you say is the most important goal for the company this year? Thank you, Pragati. I mean, as you know, Revity is still a very young company. We are only eight months old. And I think we've accomplished a lot in a very short frame of time. And I think, you know, as, as, as you know, our focus has always been on how can we explore the boundaries of uh, human potential through science. You know, that is our mission. And, you know, we work tirelessly to accomplish that on a daily basis. And I think there's still a lot to do. I think we've moved from being, you know, previously when we were in the legacy company, our relationship with our customers was more of a vendor type of a relationship. You know, and I think as we've continued to evolve our science through innovation, we've moved more into a partnership type of a relationship with our customers, where we are standing side by side with them in helping find breakthrough discoveries uh, for diseases, be their partner in their research and development, provide them diagnostics capabilities for rare diseases. So, you know, while we are doing all of that, it is still very early stages for the company and there's still a lot more to do and accomplish for us. Yes, truly. And uh, I think it's more customer centric and that will definitely help all of us to set up goals in the organization. So No, absolutely. I think, you know, just let's take an example, right? You know, if previously we used to provide products to our customers, now we've evolved into a stage where we license technology, we provide the tools and capabilities to use the technology that we have licensed, we work with our pharma partners to develop companion diagnostics for them, and then we leverage our lab infrastructure around the globe to be able to identify patients for those drug candidates for testing of their efficacy and for follow-ups. So we go through the whole value chain with our customers right now. So it's like providing them end-to-end -end solutions. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. Thank you so much, Pilat, for sharing this. And I yeah. am sure that will actually align us to set up the goals uh, for 2024. Sure. Thank you so much. Yeah. So as we um, move ahead with Levity expanding globally, uh, how do you envision India to be within the larger context of uh, uh, companies' objectives? You know, India obviously is a growth market, not just for Revity, but I think, you know, if you read any newspaper, you know, it's front and center. But India is not sort of a new phenomenon for us, right? You know, it's always been front and center for us. We've, uh, you know, if we've been in India for 35 plus years directly in the market. And, I, you know, as Revity, again, whichever, you know, uh, area of the business you look at, whether it's on software with our signals platform, or on the diagnostic side, as we continue to generate awareness around newborn screening, mm -hmm. or on the life sciences sector, which is one of the fastest growing market in India. You know, how do we build that partnership with our customers and, and build on the partnership that we already have established is going to be key for us. But India is not just, you know, from a revenue center perspective, it's also a knowledge center for us. You know, the talent that we derive out of the market and how we leverage that from a global potential that we can use is, is very critical and pertinent for the success of the company in the long term. Yes, Prilad, I truly resonate with what you just mentioned. So, of course, we have a huge talent pool in India and definitely, I believe, Revity will go to leverage on the talent pool we have in the country. Thank you. Thank you, Prahlad. In the context of India, are there any specific areas where Revity is aligning uh, itself with the government projects happening in India? Yeah, I mean, there are two specific areas where uh, we've, uh, you know, we've uh, continued to uh, explore and expand on the partnership that we have with the government. One is in the, you know, area of newborn screening, as, as I mentioned, you know. Creating awareness around newborn screening is very important. You know, there are 100 and 
30, 40 million babies born worldwide and nearly 27 million of those newborns are in India. And you know, there is still a lot of work that we as a country need to do to you know, expand, the, uh, and expand the number of newborns that are screened in the country. And, and I think that's where the partnership with the government will be essential because it has to be a government-driven initiative. The second area is around tuberculosis. You know, while we've just launched our foray with the latent tuberculosis with the launch of our T-spot test, uh, which is much more distinctive in the sense that, you know, an immunosuppressive patient where there's a large population of that patient in country, you know, T-spot is much more sensitive and specific. So, you know, leveraging that and partnering with the government with that product portfolio is going to be important. Also, as we bring out other non-invasive blood-based tuberculosis tests into the marketplace, it will become very pertinent. So I, I would say those are the two opportunities where I would say we are trying to align our efforts with the government in India. Yes, uh, Prahlad, I think uh, these are the major focus areas. And as we, you know, align ourselves with these government projects, I think more we get connected to the community. And that's what uh, we as a company aim for. Yeah, I mean, you know, you've got to create awareness because, you know, there is only the so much that the government can do. You know, you've got to have a general sense of awareness in the population as what the, you know, what is needed. Thank you for, uh, of course, creating awareness about the newborn screening in the country. I think that is much more required at the moment. And uh, I'm very happy to see the Revity's efforts in putting up and having an impact on the community. Yeah, Thank you, sure. Prahlad. Yeah. So moving ahead, I would also want to understand because we being the expertise in the healthcare sector, we wanted to understand from you, uh, you know, what, how do you perceive uh, other major healthcare challenges in the Indian community and how Revity is aiming to address them? Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, if you look at it from an, a, a, an India perspective, you know, our, our focus is the, not very different for India as it is for the globe, right? Is how do we provide differentiated technologies and capabilities to our customers so that we are able to enable researchers to be more efficient, more productive, and find cures for you know, incurable diseases now or rare diseases at a much faster pace. So essentially, if you think of from the life sciences sector, I talked about the diagnostics piece earlier, but on the life sciences sector, that is where our focus has been. And globally, and it's the same in India, we've uh, got several partnership with uh, big pharma domestic companies in India where we are again enabling the researchers there by providing them the tools and capabilities to be much more efficient and productive in their research and that will continue to be our goal that's amazing that that is truly which we were also you know aligning ourselves with the revity's objectives and uh, it's very important for us also to understand that how uh, India as a country is aligning with the global objectives as well. So thank you, Prahlad, for sharing your insights with us. It's truly inspiring to know about Revity's journey and how we are aiming to make a positive impact to the community. We wish you a very much success for the future endeavors of Revity. Thank you so much, Prahlad. Thank you so much.